Welcome to Key Tech. Please describe this channel if you are interesting in today's video. According to the news from the Associated Press, India's leader Modi stated at the Independence Day commemoration event, guarantee that the economic scale will rank among the top three in the world within five years. And all the spearheads naturally pointed to robbing. After confiscating Xiaomi's 4.8 billion assets, India sat down to confirm the joke that India makes money and spends in India, and one wants to take it home, and then formulated that India the outrageous rules of executives in India, let them occupy any good things. The Chinese-style miracle can be said to make India quite tempted. In order to realize the Global Manufacturing Center plan, Modi launched the Made in India plan in 2014. But after so many years, it seems that it has not achieved much. Any effect? And all the problems naturally come from the business atmosphere. India's rather casual rules can even be modified on the spot in order to obtain fines from foreign-funded enterprises. International companies do not even have the opportunity to appeal, which leads to the supply chain, have been unable to build it. Don't dare to invest in large-scale factories. International companies can only use imported parts and components for assembly. It is called Made in India, but in fact Modi's team is not stupid. All companies use this method. When will it be completed? As for the dream of a great country, after that, the bright snatching began. Relying on grabbing to realize the dream of a great country. Taking advantage of India's large population, it can be said that no one in the world will accept it. It is said that it is a grass on the wall, but it is full of thorns. Presumably, except for China, any developed country is his goal, but after approaching, they couldn't help but prick them. Even the United States could not avoid such treatment. American companies have entered the Indian market very early, but they have been paid various fines on the grounds of monopoly. With great potential, the patience of American companies has passed, and India has also achieved getting rich by relying on this method. After a few years of wandering, it suddenly dawned on me that such a method would not be able to realize the Made in India plan, and the products of Chinese companies are of high quality and low price, and are deeply loved by the local people. The Modi team identified it as Made in China, sabotage the overall progress has been hindered, so in the past two years, it has been targeting Chinese companies everywhere especially in the field of mobile phones. According to Indian statistics, from 2014 to 2022, the number of imported mobile phones in India has dropped from 200 million to 3.77 million, shrinking by more than 98%. Billion dropped to 2.27 million. Analysis from this data shows that India has achieved its own self-sufficiency at the mobile phone level, but obviously this kind of data has certain tricks. There is no major breakthrough in India's technological level, and the sudden drop in data is nothing more than two. Possibility, first, there is a problem with China's export, and second, Indians are forced to buy locally made mobile phones. Judging from India's ambition to commit to a made in India, there is a high probability that it restricted the shipments of Chinese companies and then confiscated Xiaomi's 4.8 billion assets 
and rejected BYD's $1 billion US dollar investment. These are all oriented actions. Let them transfer the supply chain and build an industrial chain capable of independent production in India. But it is clear that Modi's team thinks simply. Through such a grab method, it is impossible to realize his dream of a big country. Now foreign capital enters the Indian market and will carefully weigh the gains and losses. Even if India provides tens of billions of dollars in subsidies, few companies are willing to build factories, and it is even more impossible to pin their hopes on Chinese companies. What are the consequences of Modi's strong push to make in India? None of the companies operating in India can escape unwarranted fines. Since 2014, more than 3,000 foreign-funded companies have fled the Indian market. Moda's strong push for Made in India will only accelerate the loss of overseas investors, although the market is huge, but it doesn't help if the money earned can't be taken away. And India began to deceive itself. Before Apple's supply chain was perfected, the words assembled in India, assembled in India, were printed on the iPhones sold in India, directly replacing the label made in China. Lost? But no matter how the details are handled in place, the truth will never be deceived, and the reason why Xiaomi's assets of 4.8 billion will be confiscated is that it has completely fallen into the pit of India or it is running slowly. The big tariffs are trying to make these companies completely compromise made in India, and it is no longer limited to the level of imported parts and components. When the business atmosphere of a market is destroyed, it is difficult to restore it. No matter how sophisticated the tricks are, it is useless if they are used more times. Now India can only be down to earth like China, start independent research and development of technology. And India's recently launched PC product restriction plan is also based on this level. Chinese companies should be vigilant. Thank you for watching this video. What do you think of this? Please share your ideas in the comment area.